What's up everybody? It's January 1st. Happy New Year. 2016, I think was a pretty decent year. At least for the UGT Garage. Grew pretty well, so if you're a subscriber, thank you for subscribing. If you're not a subscriber, come join the fun. Thought I'd take a moment to just, like I said, wish you guys a Happy New Year. And to also go over stuff that's coming up for 2017. God, I hope it's a location change so I can get away from the traffic. Noise keeps ruining my videos. Anyway, 2017 is looking like it's going to be the year of body work. I've got two paint guns, two air compressors, big ones at Sam's Garage. The hood on the Camaro needs painted. The entire Integra needs painted. Jeep's okay for now, I guess. But so I want to paint the hood on this car. I want to paint the whole Integra, do all the body work. Um, and there's a lot coming up on that car. There's a lot coming up on the Jeep as well. Some stuff on this. I guess, uh, let's run down the list, huh? 2017 plans for the Camaro. First and foremost, paint the hood, make this thing look halfway decent. Uh, the other major thing, I need to do the engine mounts in it. So the engine's gonna come out, I'll clean up the engine, I'll respray the block and possibly a new camshaft. Nice lumpy, yeah, power. Another plan for the Camaro is to pull that rear diff cover off. And I got a set of 411 gears to put in the rear end of the Camaro, give it some more get up and go. I think that's about all I have planned for the Camaro for 2017. We'll see where it goes. Plans for the Jeep. Well, I've actually been building up a bit of a list on the Jeep. I've got a set of Rubicon coil springs to install. I have this JCR weld-it-yourself bumper. I bought that back bumper after getting rid of the really expensive one that didn't work. Uh, and there it has sat since. So I really need to get my button gear for that. I've got that. I've got JCR's hub kit. Hold on. Uh, hmm. Alright, I don't even know where my hub kit is right now. But so plans for the Jeep. Major plans. Put the coil springs in. Um, I need to change the front control arms because my bushings are wearing out. Sam has an old set off his that are upgraded front control arms. Still stock length, just tubular and good bushings. So hopefully that'll fix my death wobble. Back bumper, build my own tire swing for it. Build my own jerry can holder for it so I can put my can with all my stickers for my trip on display. Here's what I've been running on the back of my Jeep for now until I make that bumper. Just stock carrier which is overloaded by the 33. And I just kind of modified the original bumper to hold all my stuff. Oh, another thing I want to do for the Jeep. I've been drawing out plans. I want to make like an Overland style drawer system for the back of the Jeep. So we'll see if I'll get to that in 2017. Hopefully I will. A couple other little things on the Jeep and... Got some new LED headlights to put in. There may or may not be an LED light bar coming for across the roof. The other thing planning for the Jeep is the rear end is whining like crazy. I've got a uh, pinion bearing that has been long gone bad in the rear differential. Um, and not to mention with the 33s, I need to re-gear re -gear it anyway. And I'm pretty sure Q-Tech is still having a sale. So that's another big project. I might dive into the diffs and re-gear the front and rear diff and rebuild them. That would be a good time for lockers. I don't know if I'm going to have that kind of money. We'll see. Now I know a lot of my newer subscribers are here for the Integra. There is a lot coming up for the Integra. I got another set of tail lights that I'm going to polish up. I've got the wing for the Integra right here. My buddy Paul broke this thing off pushing my car when it was stuck in the snow years ago after I told him not to push on the wing. So I'm going to refiberglass that. 
and reinstall the wing. Gonna see if I could get all the body work done. Brand new paint job on it. Uh, I also picked up a new set of wheels for it. Ah, got a set of Roto Circuit 8s. I think those will look a lot better. I just need to repaint those. One of the other things coming up on it. Remember that video a while back where I was uh, putting on the chassis saver? I was saying how it just really wasn't worth spending the money to upgrade the hell out of the suspension with all those parts. Yeah, uh, so I did the opposite. I got a bunch of stuff. Not only did I get the Skunk 2 coilovers, I got Skunk 2 upper control arms with adjustable ball joints. I logged on the password JDM. I got a set of adjustable rear sway bar links, camber and tow kit, and rear lower control arms. All with Heim joints, mind you. So, going to be redoing pretty much the entire suspension on the Integra. I'll probably get a bunch of polyurethane bushings for whatever else I need. But the Integra is getting a real good work over. And, I don't know how far I'm going to get with it in 2017. But, I have here a K24 block that needs rebuilt. I would like to find a an S-type K20 head to put on it. And in this box, I have a K-Series Civic SI close ratio 6-speed transmission. So, like I said, we may start some of this build um, in 2017. Once I actually decide to go K-Series in the Integra, I'm probably going to actually start like a new video series for it. Um, so don't expect too much out of the K-Series this year, but it's something that we might see a little bit of. It's in the works. And actually, before I go full K-Swap in the Integra, um, I want to boost the B-Series. So I think that's pretty much the gist of things. Uh, Camaro is getting rear end work, some paint. Integra is getting all new suspension and body work and paint. Jeep is getting gears and back bumper and uh, possible drawer system. So as you guys can see, I've got some pretty big plans for 2017. I'm aiming pretty high. I'm shooting for a lot. I don't know that it's all going to get done. But that's the way that the channel is going to be going. That's the way the projects are going to be going. Um, so I should be having plenty of videos as long as I can manage my time and my money properly and keep stuff going. Now, I've still got a few videos from 2016 to finish editing and post up. Uh, I've got one more video of the Renegade coming. Uh, another goal I have for 2017 is to finally get off my butt and finish editing all of the footage I have from my cross-country trip. Uh, I went coast to coast and did a big loop of the entire USA. I've been taking way too long to get that done. Just ask Jerry. <laughs> He's been bugging me about it for a little while. I think he even gave up on me. But once that's finally done, that'll be posted on my other channel, Trevor Loined. It's just my personal channel. I've got a couple little adventure videos up there so far. And that's where I'm going to put like my trip videos and stuff like that. So, But I feel like I'm rambling on. I feel like this video is going to turn out like crap. <laughs> so I'm going to end it right here. Happy New Year, guys. Here's to an awesome 2017.